Hi, I'm David Wolf, president of Lupine Partners. One of the questions I hear when implementing Yardy Voyager is this. How do you approach creating a custom report from scratch? What is, what is our process? And it's taken a bit of time to get here, but the most important part is to make sure the correct data is being pulled. So we actually, do, we start in Microsoft Query Analyzer with the select statement, and it can be a quite a complex select statement taking up hundreds of rows within Query Analyzer and we usually go through a number of iterations of that but once that's done and we feel like the data is good we'll place that SQL select statement within the confines of, of a Yardy script and also integrate a dynamic filter and continue to run that report until we are getting good and accurate output out of Yardy either to a screen or to Crystal or Excel then and only then, when the, when the data is good and the Yardy report is running, will we go back and make the report look pretty. If you start at the end making the report look good, working on the cosmetics, it's a waste of time. You'll end up redoing all your work. Determining your reporting op options in Yardy Voyager, it can be complicated. My ebook, Strategies and Considerations for Reporting in Yardy Voyager, will definitely help you and is available for free. Just go to this link, fill in your name and email address, and I'll send it to you immediately. Thank you. I'm David Wolf.